This short film offers an unflinching portrait of life in the slums of Nairobi, seen through the eyes of the teenagers who live there. My name is Elvin and I'm 19 years old. My name is Francisca. My name is Kelvin. I come from Matare. Yes, there is crime, violence and drug abuse in these narrow alleyways. But Tales from the Slums also shows us friendship, talent and hope. And it's those values, the chance to succeed and become the person you want to be, that this film is all about. Tales from the Slums is one of three short movies by young people from challenging backgrounds to be screened at Cannes this year. They're the result of educational workshops run by Films Without Borders, a UK-based charity. Films Without Borders started 10 years ago with the aim of breaking down barriers, building bridges and creating a dialogue while simultaneously teaching young people the first stages of film production. The first task was to find the teenagers who would work on the film. Mita Vora went into the slums and interviewed hundreds of young people. The ones that we selected, they each had a spark in them. This spark of, I am going to use this, I am going to push the door down, and I am going to make this happen for myself. The Cannes Film Festival is best known as a showcase for Hollywood stars and the latest big budget movies. But another important mission of the festival is to encourage the development of the film industry throughout the world. As for these young filmmakers, four of them have secured internships with Kenya's largest broadcaster. So Tales from the Slums is also a film with a happy ending. Jackie Rowland, Al Jazeera, at the Cannes Film Festival.